On Blythewood Road, Mitcham, South Australia, there is what appears to be a large cemetery. It is in fact three different cemeteries next to one another. The Mitcham Anglican Cemetery, the Mitcham General Cemetery, and the Congregation of the Sisters of St. Joseph's Cemetery. Each cemetery is administered by a different authority. The first cemetery to be used was the Anglican. Mary Oldham, who was about 32 when she died, was buried here on the 23rd of September 1853. Many notable people in Adelaide's history are also buried here. Robert Barr Smith, a 19th century philanthropist, and his son Thomas Elder Barr Smith, after whom the Library of the University of Adelaide is named. Peter Waite, whose estate was bequeathed to the same university, and is now an agricultural campus and arboretum. Lawrence Wells, one of the explorers who mapped Central Australia, a colourful early police commissioner, Alexander Tolmer, and various successful merchants are buried here.
the Mitcham General Cemetery, was set aside for the burials of nonconformists, with the first interment being on the 3rd of November 1853. A young man of 27 who died of consumption, named William F. Heath. Among those buried here is Sir Sidney Kidman, once the largest private landowner in the world, whose cattle empire was larger than England, Scotland, Ireland and Wales combined. The smallest of the cemeteries is set aside for the Sisters of St. Joseph of the Sacred Heart, a Roman Catholic order of nuns known as the Brown Joeys, founded in South Australia in 1866. The cemetery is on the site of a former convent that operated from 1881 to 1914. It was demolished in 1924.